Halo sobat gamer dimanapun kamu berada Di video kali ini kita akan melanjutkan game Gears 5 Petualangan Kate dan Dell Di daerah utara yang penuh salju Bagaimana kelanjutan ceritanya Kita mainkan gamenya Let's check it out Ini lab kedua lagi nyari lab guys Laboratorium Suara siapa tuh? Trap with Friday, I think. Need to overload the generator. Sounds like that did the trick. Shit, we didn't get all of them. Gotta be another generator somewhere. Oh, 
to to uh, stuck me. You're this upset about a pinprick? I have sensitive hands. Proper identification is required for entry. Your entry has been oh, denied. Oh, like that, that Today. Uh, what? Niles, is that you? Proper identification is required for entry. Proper identification. Hey, you can give it a shot, but it's gonna hurt more than you think. that welcome home do you really require an explanation i think i like the gibberish spouting novels more than this cryptic garbage game ah i see you've met my vastly inferior construct at new hope what the hell it's freezing in here goodness Ooh. apparently some of our cryojets are malfunctioning there must be a fault in our system you don't say of course, we cannot proceed until those cryojets are disabled. Would you mind, terribly? Miserable little garbage care mother. Cryojets are probably powered like the turrets. Let's find a generator. Cari generator lagi. Well done. Jack's good. I've been meaning to reset those cryojets for quite some time. you explaining this oh nothing but the remains of an old industrial accident Dell, these tanks same as the ones at new hope yeah i noticed ah yes my work there began as an effort to cure children ill with rust lung but it grew into something far more significant the cog wanted medicine i gave them gods oh well water under the bridge Please, this way. So after the cog shut you down, why come all the way out here? Our family needed a place to continue our work in solitude. <laughs> no way your family built this alone. I am quite certain you lack the necessary clearances for that information. This next area is quite fascinating. What the hell? The path to every breakthrough is paved with failure. Here are some of our more unstable specimens. This breakthrough of yours, how did you manage it? One of the miners' children, as it happens. She was resistant to aging, disease. We raised her as our own. Interesting. 
What is it? That is one of our first successful hybrids. Hybrid? You mean a locust? One and the same. In our previous facility, we had problems with genetic stability. The sires were distempered and sterile. A problem for obvious reasons. But the locusts were different. Highly controllable, the perfect soldiers, and blessedly able to reproduce. What made them different? Their cells. You see, the emulsion miners' children provided a marvelous genetic repository, as did the indigenous creatures of the Hollow. In all of your genetic research, it's in here? Of course. Oh, shit. Hey, hey, Jack, Jack, come here! I need you to download everything off this terminal. Oh, man. I don't think I want to know what any of these file names mean. But when the extent of one very special child's genetic immunity to emotion became clear, our work began to soar. Please, go ahead. That, of course, is Mira, or as you know her, Queen Mira. You bred her with the sires? Nothing so monstrous. Her stem cells, however, were delightfully complementary to sire DNA. But we underestimated so much. Young Mira's strong maternal feelings, for instance. Let me guess. She led her children to slaughter you all. No, no, no. Well, yes. But I meant her more traditional maternal feelings. For her daughter. Little Raina. Your mother. What? You're lying. I am not. Your mother was born here, and taken from us by her spineless father, thus causing young Mira's unfortunate rebellion. Why are you telling me this? You have so many gifts, you do not yet understand. Hey, what's going on? He will kill you if he knows. They all will. What did you just say? Hey, hey, what are you... Why did you come here with me? What did J.D. tell you? Kate, I am not gonna hurt you. No? Maybe you should. Or maybe I should. Hey. That would indeed sever the link between you and the Locust. Now, shut up! I won't let them do to me what they did to my mother. Your mother? And what did they do to your mother? In the hive. They changed her. It killed her. I killed her. But that is the process that allows them to learn, to grow. Without a queen, they remain unguided. See? See? I'm a weapon. No. You're not. Back in the village, when I was inside that snatcher, I was controlling them. What? I think I killed Oscar. Wait a minute. You think? Or you did? I don't know. I don't know. I just... I want it out of my head. I want it to stop. And you're gonna stop it. And if I do not? Then we delete you and destroy every bit of your precious research. Then please, allow me to assist you. And we're supposed to just trust your good word here? You are free to trust or not trust whomever you like. But tell me something. Your mother and the Hive, did she resist? Of course she did. So I feared. Young Mira needed no such crude incorporation. Niles, tell me something. My grandfather, 
Who was he? One of my best geneticists. He fled with little Rayna because he no longer believed in our work. Did Mira know where he took her? I told Mira Rayna had perished in the escape attempt. I assumed that would end the matter. I greatly miscalculated. But it appears we have another malfunction. Perhaps you could address it? Right. is quite handy. Hey, watch the garbage can. Check spoken. Well, you do make a lovely couple. <laughs> Would you please follow me? Rada ketinggalan. If you would, can't have you wandering about unsupervised. Almost there now. I'm curious. How does it feel to have your life's work turn on you? I choose to view it differently. The Locust longed for independence. Mira showed them the way. I have always been proud of your grandmother. I still am. What the hell is that thing? The matriarch was generated from your grandmother's stem cells and sire yeah, DNA. She amplified. This device is where Mira first learned to control her power, but we can also use it to sever your leg if you choose. So, how does it work? By mildly damaging your brain. What? By mildly damaging her brain? Her connection to the locust is based on a genetic algorithm inside her temporal lobe. Altering that requires anesthesia, you could say. It sounds like a lobotomy. A lobotomy is highly invasive. This is directed. While I work, the matriarch will guide your mind, undetected, to where it must go. Okay, all right. No, 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 no. no. You are not doing this. I do not trust this can. Then watch him. But I have to do this. I'm losing control. I won't hurt anyone else, understood? Understood. Sur 
lawan monster itu kacau lah guys dia mengendalikan sampah lagi gitu. para kabur pula ya lagi tuh
Surely you see I've done you a kindness. You are no longer vulnerable to the hive mind and your mother has been awakened. Well, so to speak. Oh, I'm gonna fucking kill you! I don't think you can hear us. I don't give a shit! Stop. Look for a way through. I'm gonna make him pay. You're not gonna do anything but freeze if we don't lift this lockdown. Shit! I think this was Niles. Then slap his hand on that scanner. Put this whole place in a deep freeze right before he bled to death. Good fucking riddance. Uh, Dump? The matriarch is gone. Oh, I'm sure that's not gonna be. Let's just find knives. Come on. Tell me what the hell Niles is talking about? Later, after we deal with Niles. This will work. 
designed to withstand generational conflict. They may withdraw, they may hibernate, but they will always return. We have seen to that. I'm really looking forward to shutting that garbage can up! Got you! Okay, it looks like we're clear. Then let's keep moving. Niles can't get away. There's got to be a way to open it. Maybe there's something Jack can do. Jack, see where that leads. Okay, more locusts are coming. Then hold them off. Hey, Jack, don't take your time on this. Oh, it's been so long since my sires have run free. 
That's all of them. So then let's keep after Niles. Come on. Hey, Niles! We're still coming! I really don't think he can hear you. I really don't care! Let's follow his trip. Wait, Del! There he is! Who the? be undone. This planet is now theirs. I told you I'd get you. Back. Huh? 
I'll see you.
Kolega. She would, if she could. But she's not my mother anymore. Then who is she? Their queen. Come on, time to get out of here. Hello, finally. Back to world civilization. They've really got their queen. And Nas is right about what happens next. We need a new plan. No, we need the old plan. We need the Hammer of Dawn. Oh, thank God. Oh, no, they don't Looks like you need a ride. How'd you find us? You think I'm gonna give you a one-of-a-kind piece of tech without the ability to track it to the center of the planet? <laughs> yeah, yeah, fine. And speaking of one-of-a-kinds, help me hook up this skiff. You find what you're looking for? Yeah. And now we need to kill it. Is she, you know, all right? Not really. But let me ask you something. How long would it take to get the Hammer of Dawn up and running? Funny you should ask. The data drive you found months ago about the UIR. Yeah? Interesting stuff. Interesting how? You'll see. And lucky for us, I have an old UIR contact. Take us home, Sam. Got it, sweet cheeks. Public secret space program. Never been in UIR territory before. You still have it. Vascar was independent. The UIR had the pleasure of occupying. No, excuse me. Liberating this glorious land. Okay. Remember how I told you only pissed off nomads lived out here now? Meet Garen Paddock, the most pissed off and nomadic of them all. This is your old UIR contact? Two things I dislike, Baird. The cog and children. You brought me both. Two things I dislike? Old men and deserts. And yet, here we are. 
<laughs> I like this one. Follow me. So, it turns out the UIR space program went way beyond what the COG publicly revealed. Somewhere in this Cosmodrome here, there's a rocket loaded with functional Hammer of Dawn satellites. I think we can get the entire system back online and start hitting the swarm where they live. If the UIR has satellites during the Pendulum Wars, why didn't you use them? The politicians wanted their armistice. Launching those satellites would have guaranteed another century of war. But still, someone our military tried to launch. It kinda triggered a small civil war, actually. So we know this Cosmodrome's layout. Where are the satellites? Try the rocket hangar. Here. And the wind flares are too severe to fly over that desert. So that's where your skiff comes in. Question. How do we know these satellites are still functioning? Or if they're even compatible with ours? Answer. We don't. And that's where you come in. Unless you're too cowardly. Or stupid. Or weak. <laughs> Who is that? A friend, believe it or not. But for now, get to know the layout of that place. There's a good chance most of it's buried in sand. Oh, and uh, come and see me before you go. Notice the part where no one's sure this will work. I don't care. We'll make it work. We have to. Maybe it's time you told me exactly what you saw in that machine. It's not what I saw. It's... It's what I felt. They have a queen now. They're not gonna stop. Look, I woke her up. So I have to stop her. Yeah, but this isn't all on you. Come on. Let's just go see Baird. Oke okay, sobat gamer dimanapun kamu berada sampai di sini dulu petualangan kita di Gears 5 kali ini akan kita lanjutkan di video berikutnya subscribe dan like channel saya jika kamu menyukainya sampai jumpa bye bye.